Welcome to our program on Kardec Radio. Good morning, dear friends. You and I are invited to join forces so we can benefit from this day, not only for ourselves, but for the general good. We are here to read a message by the Spirit of Emmanuel in the book Family. This book is not yet in English, but it's available in Portuguese in PDF. Through Chico Xavier, several spirits wrote messages about family in this book. And we are relaying them here to you. This message today is about before birth. Emmanuel tells us that almost often, before birth, the human soul is fully awake and knows the great part of that that asks us to begin a new incarnation. Many times, with the help of benefactors in the beyond, they help us select the new experiences, the chart of trials that we need to go through with humility and renunciation. Many candidates to the new beginning of the learning experience on the earth tremble cry, debating about the new beginning, feeling afraid about the new reincarnation. It is then that the affection of the parents may bring them a sweet refuge. In the nourishing climate of the home, the anxieties are quieted down a new light of understanding and prayer help the new journey of redemption. However, if the parents at this time are not able to support that soul because of their indifference or discord, maladjustments or infirmities, then it will be difficult because abortion and imbalances will become, will appear as afflictions. Friendly parents instead may open the new pathway of the rebirth in prayer, care, charity, and peace because the parents are responsible in the light of reincarnation for those that come back in the name of the Lord supplicating shelter in order to improve themselves and serve offering them at the same time the most noble opportunities of elevation Emmanuel in this message gives to us this two-way road. We need to reincarnate our parents open the doors. They are responsible for helping us. And in our turn, we are also responsible for giving them a hand in their elevation. It's about family. It's teamwork effort. What about us? Where are we in that regard? Are we aware that we need to help, not only to be helped? Let us meditate upon this and see how we can calibrate our families in the light of understanding, prayer, charity, and peace. And thus, be in greater harmony. Let us pray then. 
Dear God, this life is so precious and we rejoice with you in the opportunity of renewing ourselves. The plan before this reincarnation was so thorough Forgive us for falling in the traps of illusions. May we readjust ourselves in time to fulfill the reincarnatory plan of this life. Do not allow us, please do not allow us to postpone, to derail. We don't want to give up either because we know that you love us immensely and that you are always investing on us so we can team up with you in this beautiful universe. Thank you so much for blessing our homes our communities, our neighbors. Thank you for helping us be useful somewhat. And we pray that the ones who are suffering the most feel the shower of healing light. Onto them, bringing the warmth relief for their pains, sorrows, and afflictions. We visualize our whole planet Earth enveloped by your loving kindness today and always. And so be it. We need to think about our reincarnatory plan. Even if you don't remember, that's okay. We have an intuition. We have guardian angels, spirit protectors to help us out. What is important is to work within ourselves. It's not necessarily about deeds external to us. It's about the inner deeds. Let us then rejoice in the opportunity that we have received to be here on this planet. Thank you, friends. Stay tuned at Cardiac Radio because there's always more. And if you want to listen to podcasts, if you want to go to our other platforms, just go to our website or our app where you're going to find all the other opportunities to listen to Cardiac Radio on demand or 24-7. Thank you, friends, and until next time.